So good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It is my pleasure to welcome you all to the beautiful surroundings of Hain Barn on this very special occasion, the marriage of Michael and Brianna. You are sharing something rare and beautiful. Inspire each other by sharing your accomplishments. Always speak the truth and listen attentively so you may understand each other's thoughts and intentions. Say, I love you, often, to retain the warmth between you. Remember to laugh a lot, even when you're angry. After all, you are each other's best friends. Stand together and for each other and always be content in mind and spirit and make each day a blessing and a fulfilment of your dreams. Cherish this very special moment in your lives. You are holding the hands of your lover, your comforter, and your best friend. They are the hands that will reach for yours in times of joy and in times of sadness. And although it is your hands that touch, it is your hearts that will hold you together, not only today, but tomorrow and forever. Michael and Brianna. You have both made the declarations prescribed by law, and together with the long tradition of the giving and receiving of rings, you have made a solemn and binding contract in our presence and in the presence of your family and friends who are here today as your witnesses. It gives me very great pleasure to pronounce that you are now husband and wife. You may kiss your wife. <laughs> Words cannot describe how lucky I feel and how grateful I am that you are now my wife. You look even more beautiful today than I knew you would. This week, as you, as you know, I was getting quite annoyed with the prospect of the rain and the weather forecast, um, but now I realise that it doesn't matter as you're the only thing that I've been able to look at today anyway. Oh. <laughs> Most of all, I thank you for always being there for me without fail, for the good days and the bad, and the high points and the moments of self-doubt, when I jump out and scare you five times a day, <laughs> when I get overexcited and silly and make noises for no reason and annoy the neighbours, when I ask too much of you, like agreeing to re-render the house two weeks before our wedding, or for spending countless weekends on your own whilst I study, or going for months without spending money or treating ourselves so that we can invest and pay for something that I've strategized and researched.
during our seven years together, we've been through a lot, but nothing ever feels to me like it will be too much, knowing that you are there by my side. So I'd like to raise a toast to this unbelievable woman, and cheers the bride. Yeah. 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 Yeah.